deal real quick. The first one that lasts is out the door. <laughs> Want to tell us if, um, some of your influences that you guys have? Northline. The EP's called Chances. The EP is pretty much like a low card metalcore. I don't know. Yeah. Bit heavier, big broke down. Yeah. Sit on the side, guys. <laughs> oh, I guess subliminal. Yeah. 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 Subliminal messaging. Mason does it all. This kid, this kid right here. <laughs> There's gonna be backflips and fireworks. <laughs> Maybe a broken neck. Who would you want to share a stage with? Jason Slayer. Slayer. Slayer, definitely. Well, honestly, probably Parkway Drive since they're Australia's biggest metal band and without yeah. Yeah. Australian music, it would probably be no one. So, uh, yeah, I'm still going to say Jason Slayer. Any pre rituals before shows? <laughs> Sam, Sam paces back and forth nervously. The whole, the whole, that day of the show, he'll wake up that morning stressed out, pacing his hallway. He's going to get to his house to pick up his kid. And he, him and his mum have already had like five full one fights because they're both stressed out about the day. I care for nothing but the band in my life. <laughs> He's not wrong. If you guys could have like any superpowers, what would they be? <sighs> I'm gonna say invisible. I'd be able to run through walls. So it'd be easy. What's the point of that? Oh, you can run through walls. You don't have to get past the door. Why can't I make you try and do it? Thanks for the interview, guys. Cool. Right, what's up, guys? We're in Elegance, and we will see you at Youth Fest. <laughs> can you believe that in that last bit where he's like, why are you laughing?